Good morning. Today's Bible verse of the day comes from James chapter 1 verse 19. It reads as follows, Understand this, my dear brothers and sisters, you must all be quick to listen, slow to speak, and slow to get angry. Three, three points he's telling us there. Quick to listen, slow to speak, slow to get angry. I like to read the whole context of the verse, and usually I do that by reading the verse prior and the voice uh, verse after. Uh, verse 18 says, He chose to give birth to us by giving us his true word, and we out of all creation became his prized possession. Understand this, my dear brothers and sisters, you must all be quick to listen, slow to speak, and slow to get angry. Verse 20 reads, Human anger does not produce the righteousness God desires. Okay. The whole context of James chapter 1 is uh, speaking of uh, trials and tribulations, testing. And in verse 5, he says, If you lack wisdom of how to get through this, then we are to ask God. Well, we're asking God, to help us and and so God has given us that knowledge and that he says here understand this now let's let's get that wisdom let's get it let's make it applicable to our lives he says quick to listen listen to what listen to his true word i believe from verse 18 so we must listen slow to speak let's not jump off the deep end you know, let's not let's not uh, be haste in 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 going through our our afflictions that that come through us daily at work, at home, wherever we may be. And finally, slow to get angry. Why? Because human anger does not produce the righteousness God desires. That is the ultimate goal that God is seeking from us. That the righteousness that God desires be produced within us. Okay? And we know that righteousness. And I believe it, it leads us to that fruit of the Spirit. And when we get out of that sinful nature of ours and get into the right, right in tune with the Spirit, then that righteousness of God is being produced. My friends, may you have a good, blessed, Day may God's grace fill you today. Love y'all.